Hello everybody, Smart Cowboy here. I wanted to do a video on uh, if this is legal on YouTube. I want to do a video response to my video I did <laughs> on the uh, on those side bags brackets that I got. I can tell you about about what I've decided on those. Thank you for everybody's response on that. I appreciate that. And uh, I did think about uh, making some brackets of my own um, to make those side bags fit. But I put it to the side there. I'll show you pictures. I'll show you a picture right here on how wide that would be. So I was looking on eBay for a GV uh, side bags, and then I looked at the eBay uh, ad that they had for these brackets, and I noticed that they had GV um, side bags on those. Well, I'll show you a picture of that right here. So I saw those uh, bags. And they're uh, GVE 21s. That's 21 liters of storage. On uh, on a, on one bag, they come in a set, and they're top loading. So and waterproof. So I'm thinking, well, you know, if I do make a bracket for those other ones, that's going to be really wide. It's going to be really wide. You know, going in between the car and the truck, pulling into the driveway, and I'm afraid that I'll tag Sharon's car, which is a new car, and I'm never the, the end of that. Or I tag my truck, which is no big deal because it's scratched up like a cat's scratching post. And then I saw those bags on there, and they're narrower, and like I said before, they're top loading and waterproof. So on the uh, top box, top box. <laughs> Try to say that fast. Top box bag bags that you use, you have to open it, and they come, you know, like a like a door there, and all your stuff would be, you know, you'd have to try to prop it up so all your stuff wouldn't fall out on the ground or anything. And you know, I'm thinking of these top box, these top loading GV boxes are narrower, and you get it from the top, and they're waterproof, so I have to worry about stuff getting wet on the inside so having to drop back and punt what I'm gonna do is uh, go ahead and get those GV bags they're a hundred and about hundred and seventy nine hundred eighty dollars and that's with shipping that's free shipping on that and out of a motorcycle superstore I've purchased stuff from there before and they uh, have really fast shipping and uh, uh, really good people there. I shop with them three, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten times. So I'm going to order those Monday and uh, get those in, and then I'll make a a video on the uh, installation of the brackets, the before and after pictures with the top boxes on it. And uh, and I forgot to tell you, I got a uh, we, we went to Claim Jumpers last night and had a birthday supper. Met my picked up my son-in-law and met my daughter up there when she got off work, and they gave me a twenty-five dollar gift certificate to Best Buy, which is cool, and a card. It was really nice. And my wife also got me a Sons of Arthritis T-shirt. Now, if you're not familiar with Sons of Arthritis, it's just a pun on. Uh, don't do it. It's just a pun on Sons of Anarchy and uh, for us old farts that still ride. And uh, and it's like a biker biker club type thing. But this is the this is the T-shirt that I got uh, from my wife for my birthday. Yeah, it's pretty cool, man. It's got uh, looks like a real uh, biker biker gang 
I think I'm going to call my chapter the cripples. <laughs> but uh, that's pretty cool. I really, I really enjoyed, really liked that shirt. I wore it last night to uh, uh, Opry Mills for the for the supper. But I just want to do a short video response to my own video and let people know about that, about what my intentions are, and what, what'll be what a video will be coming up in the near future. So. I guess we'll we'll call it a call it a wrap here. This is a Smyrna cowboy here in Laverne, Tennessee. Wishing you and yours a good day. And until next time, adios.